Hi there. I'd like to do a quick update. So I think metaphysics of quality is a philosophy whose time has come. I've, I've reiterated this several times and I'm going to reiterate why I think it's time to take it seriously. We need a way of seeing things that tap into the deep patterns of the universe. And this may sound airy-fairy, but I think it's far from that, in my opinion. Remember that the metaphysics of quality was, was devised by someone who was an accomplished scientist, among other things. Um, in fact, several very functional philosophies, not the least of which are Zen Buddhism and James Pragmatism, William James Pragmat Pragmatism, married up into a very useful way to operate in the world. In Zen and the Art of Motorcycle Maintenance, Phaedrus realizes that hypotheses are pretty much infinite. So how do you figure out what's right, what's best? And that was the catalyst for finding the ghost of reason that said that there was a good that could be arrived at uh, dialectically, a good that could be arrived at through science. And once Phaedrus found that ghost of reason, he thrashed it good. Phaedrus knew a new metaphysics was in order, one that could discern the best. And so now we, because we have so many facts at our disposal with the internet, you know, with technology, we really need a new way of conceptualizing what's best. Otherwise, we're stuck in relying on reason for this job. And if we rely on reason with all this information, what we can do is we can construct these alternate, you know, these realities from the same facts that are just as credible but have nothing to do with each other. Look at what's happening politically. Look at, you know, just think of Yanni and Laurel, for example, if you want a metaphor for that. Um, so you can see why it is being said that facts don't matter. Because information has become so complex that our old subject-object metaphysics can't handle it anymore. Remember in the breakdown of the bicameral mind, um, once language be became... Uh, rich with metaphors to the point where you could abstract, uh, hold abstractions in your mind, then, then people didn't need the gods anymore. And that is how, that is a, a stage of evolution of consciousness. And now I believe we're at another stage of evolution of consciousness where the metaphysics we've been using for so long are just not working. And you see this kind of emerging in, in different people's uh, viewpoints. The Sam Harris, you know, the trouble that Sam Harris and Jordan Peterson were having with truth is a good example with, with Peterson's more mythic truth be, um, emerging as the one that was becoming more useful in, in this time. Um, another reason I'm doing this update is I'm wondering if anyone wants to read um, start with Zen and the Art of Motorcycle Maintenance and go through Lila and just like read a chapter a week and we just um, get together on YouTube somehow or another and talk about it. If anyone's interested, let me know because I have some ideas for that. Um, uh, tomorrow I, uh, I had someone ask, ask me a question in the comments section, which is very good, which I think is a, an important question, and I'm going to address that tomorrow in a full length video, um, hopefully that I'll post uh, Sunday or Monday. So I hope that made sense, and I'll see you next time.